This is terrible. It's unappealing, unimaginative, and just unacceptable. But it's a, it's a commentary on today's society. Can't you see the symbology? Quite frankly, I don't. You have a week to turn around, and if you don't turn around and do a new project, I'll contact every single college that you apply to and make sure that you do not get in. Gentlemen, consider the following. Today we face a task, a task more horrifying and terrible than any team of elites has ever faced before. We must embrace this task, love it, hold it, and respect it. It has to make you laugh, cry, hate, and scream in horror, but most importantly, this has to be good. Alright, brainstorming session. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay, so we've got this guy. And he's a ghost. No, a stalker. A ghost stalker? But is it a stalker that is a ghost, or a guy that stalks ghosts? This is stupid! What about a first-person zombie movie? Jeepers Creepers, Watson! That was our first idea, and Robinson rejected it! And first-person makes me sick. I don't remember Mr. Robinson rejecting this. This is terrible. It's unappealing, unimaginable, and just unacceptable. <laughs> Whoa. All right, how about something dark? A girl falls in love. With a darkness. No, not that little. I have an idea. Okay, so half an hour of explosions. With a plot twist. What? Good, good, good. I feel like, like it's lacking meaning. Maybe a reference to my religion, Pastafarianism. Pasta what now? You know, the worshipping of the flying spaghetti monster. No, moving on. I'm thinking something more along the lines of a musical. I can't sing. That's not a problem. They'll be too preoccupied with a dark plot twist. So, here's where we stand. An original romantic comedy horror musical about a Pastafarian ghost stalker who falls in love with an angel of darkness only to lose her to 30 minutes of explosions. I'm loving it! <laughs> nice. Genius. Beautiful. Groovy. Explosions. Fantastic. Let's get moving. For the following week, we live under a strict code. Break this code and you put the entire group at risk. Rule number one, never look directly at the camera. Rule number two, never look directly at the camera. Don't even get me started on rule number three. The first thing we have to do is take care of all this legal work. That's why we have you, Cameron. I prepared some light reading for you. Godspeed. Next up, we've got casting. Eric and Watson, that's your job. I want you to go out and find the dirtiest and cheapest hobo possible. easy on you, Kimchi. You're in charge of costumes, makeup, catering, funding, marketing, writing the script, and whatever goes along with that. But... No buts. I'm not giving you any more work even if you ask. And tell Emily she's editing! And I, I, will direct. And action! So I fell in love with this thing Don't know what it is, but I gotta sing So lovely and creepy, incredibly pale All I can ask is that this ghost is female La 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 la, pasta fairy in Ghost stalker I love you, I love you, I love you, baby, yeah No! Hobo! Get 
Okay, one more time, people, from the top. I can't take this anymore. I'm going to my trailer. Fine. Okay, people, that's a wrap. <laughs> Now's your chance, Emily. You can make this film a work of art, a masterpiece. We have the technology. Get busy. How's the project coming, Emily? It's due in 10 minutes. Crap. Uh... Well, at least you tried your best. I guess we'll just give it to Robinson. I hope you guys are satisfied with it, because I'm not.